Events while guarding the Bofors gun is uh, a play about a group of soldiers in West Germany in 1954. Uh, some of them are doing their national service, some of them are career soldiers, uh, and there are tensions between the two, and it boils down to a, 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 a battle of wills between uh, uh, this one Irish soldier who's, uh, who's seen a lot of um, active service, seen a lot of violence, has lived a very violent life, and the very inexperienced uh, uh, Lance Bombardier, who's in charge of in, in charge of this uh, unit of soldiers. He's the the sort of fresh Bombardier um, who's trying to control a bunch of uh, squaddies who are a lot older than him, a lot more rougher than him. Um, I have a certain rebellious streak that makes me rather hard to control. Um. Y'all have the uh, orders for this guard. Two men on duty. One man patrols the perimeter wire, the other man guards the gun park itself. Make sure nobody mucks about with the truck's petrol tanks, spare tyres, tool kits and so on. And keep an eye out for the Bofors guns. Make sure nobody interferes with them. Question! Sir! Is it tonight we were expecting the Russians to attack? Would you see it? Have been assigned on this particular fateful night to guard uh, a Bofors gun, which is a, 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 an anti-aircraft gun that is actually um, is obsolete and has been for many years. So. Permission to speak again, sir! Yes, what is it? Now, why would you say we were guarding the Bofors gun, Lance Bombardier? What I didn't see, which is what um, working with a, a, a brilliant group of actors gives you, is, is what I didn't see are, are, are all the other stories that are in there start to want to know more about why uh, why Flynn is so interested in, in Evans and, uh, and why Crawley can't seem to stand row. Gunnar Flynn is a career soldier. He's one of the, he's, I think he's the oldest of the, of the soldiers. So Featherstone is a um, bit of a company troublemaker. We've both served a term of service, haven't we? We're not national National service boys. So I mean, we're um, Regular, we're right? regulars. Yeah, he's a a simple lad. enjoys the um, enjoys being told what to do, really, and having a structure to his day. And the second lieutenant, who's quite young, he uh, just he uh, enjoys the inspection, and uh, he's a bit oblivious to the world that the the men are are, are in. And it's funny, uh, and it's moving, and uh, it, it has uh, just it just has a great story, a great gripping story. Um, it's it's a terrific play, and I'm really really excited to be working on it.